Hey, what is up guys? It's Pokemon Nostalgia and I want to show you guys my return. Excuse the background, but check this out. This is not one of my returns. I just bought this and uh, it got here today. The The case is pretty scratched up. Check that out. Damn. Definitely seen better days, but you know what? The good thing is that these are going to get regraded with the new slab and I'm going to have a brand, brand new slab. Yep, and then I got this one too. This Leafy on PSA 10 from Crown Zenith. I'm actually gonna try to see and uh, if I could acquire all the uh, the full the full uh, set. Well, not the full set, but only the Hollows and the Gallery and Gallery. Um, like the only the ones I like, because some of them like the toxicity and stuff. Well, why would I want those? But look, check this out. I got all that to show you guys. So, it's 40, 40 cards. So, well, let's start. So, first, Japanese card. Uh, can I cover this? Uh, let, I'll try to see if I can use... Oh, <laughs> I did the wrong side. A P, uh, PSA 5. I see you see 5 Blaine's Arcanine. Beautiful. Let me see. Let me see if I can get something, a piece of paper something to cover the grade all right i got it so this one is next and it's uh oh the base set charizard and this is check that out it's a black dot error has that error right there if you guys can see it right there it's a black dot error. Uh, I think I guessed a six on this. A five. There you go. This one is gonna sell for four hundred dollars, or maybe four fifty. Uh, just depends. I gotta, I gotta see. But I know a lot. I know a few people already want it. So that's number two right there. And next card is this let me cover flip it around a miriam uh i think maybe a nine a nine oh like damn yeah a nine yep a nine and this one will go up for sale if you guys are interested maybe about eighty dollars What else we got next? Let me move these a little bit more over here. Okay, perfect. What we got next? <laughs> Damn, I'm not good at covering these numbers. 9.5 Rayquaza. This one is strain is going straight to my personal collection. Look at this beauty. That's a $200 card. Look at this beauty. I actually sold mine. I, I sold mine a few. Uh, a few months ago for a hundred and eighty dollars and ever since then I've been wanting it back and now I got another one but the the good thing is I only paid eighty dollars for it and then fifteen dollars to grade it so a two hundred dollar card that's a beautiful card right there straight to my personal collection oops what we got next Um, ah shit, Zinnia's Resolve, a 9. I was actually hoping this would get a better grade than a 9, but I did, I did see some a little nick on the top and one at the bottom. Somewhere, but yeah, they were there. So if anyone's interested in these uh, wa waifus, I'm going to put them up for sale. And then we got, damn it. Ooh, this beautiful Dragonite V that's going to my personal collection. If it's a 9.5, it's a $200 card. And it is, yes, a 9.5. Straight to my collection. $200 card. That's what they're selling for. They're selling for like 180 but then after taxes, because taxes are not ghosts, you got to pay those taxes. About two hundred dollars. 
Nice, right? Straight to my collection. What else we got? We got, ooh, Shining Gyarados, and this one is going to go up for sale. I do have one already, so I don't need another one. 4.5, so that will make it a $250 card. And I think I think I got a buyer for this one already. So check back because I think somebody's gonna take this one for two hundred. No, actually for three hundred dollars. I'm gonna sell it for three hundred dollars, and someone is already gonna take it. Beautiful card. Next we got Alexam. I'm not sure what this is gonna grade. Six point five. It's a beautiful artwork. Who could beat the base set artwork of Alakazam? And I think this one's going to go up for 40. I got to check prices. I'm the prices that I'm saying right now is not is not set in stone. You know what? I'm just going to cover the number. Okay, so we got a um, we got a Lieutenant Surge's Fero. Look at that swirl. Damn. And it does look pretty beat up. So maybe a 5. Oh, yes, 5.5. There we go. I know somebody wanted this uh, Lieutenant Surge's Fero, but I don't know what grade they will accept, but maybe a $40 card. All of these average around 40. So we got Articuno. Um, I do see some scratches, maybe a six. Yep. Articuno, Fossil, six. You know what? I'm actually surprised it got a six. What else we got? A Zapdos. Uh, it looks. It does have some. A little bit of scuffing. Maybe a six point six point five. Oh, a five! Damn. Yep. What else we got? Oh yes, going straight to my personal collection. My favorite Charizard artwork. Cause look at that. He's fighting Venusaur over there. Uh this one is gonna be uh 8.5. Yes, yeah, it's, it's right on the right side it's real heavy. You see? And thin on the left side. So this one is going straight to my personal collection and I think it's a hundred and fifty dollar card. So yep. What else do we got? Blaine's Moltres. Hmm. This one actually looks pretty good. Maybe a 7? 7. 7.5. There you go. All of these are going to go for sale. Except these right here. They're going to my personal collection. Well, that Gyarados, I bought it. So, What we got? What do we got? Jolteon? Okay. Let's see. A eight from Pop Series 3. If anybody. Oh, look at that swirl. Nice. Anybody wants it? Let me know. Let's see what we got. <laughs> A Redacto First Edition pre release stamp. There you go. Anybody like that? Aerodactyl? Yep. Uh, what else do we got? Oh, Dark Charizard. Let's see what it graded. A 4.5. Damn, that's pretty rough. You know what? I actually sold a Charizard, uh, even rougher Charizard. I think it was a 3.5. And it sold for $60, so I, I might put this one for $80. Look at that. What do we got here? Oh, wrong side. Lieutenant Surges Electabuzz. Actually, somebody on the Discord wanted this. So, there you go. What else do, do we got? <laughs> uh, Night of Queen 6.5 Japanese. Anybody a fan of Night of Queen? 
I'm actually a fan of Nido King. Home Doom from Neo Genesis. And it is a 4.5. Yeah, it is pretty rough. But hey, it's still a, actually it's still an $80 card. I checked recent prices on this. It's still about an $80 card. Cause I know I knew it was gonna grade rough because um it has a crease, I think. Somewhere around here. Yeah, it has a crease somewhere. I know I, I know I wasn't blind. I know it has a crease somewhere. Oh yeah, right here. Right there. Yep. So 4.5, $80 card. Who could beat that artwork? Look at that. That is a badass artwork. Next up, we got Victory Bell First Edition. What do what did we grade? Mm, 5.5 for First Edition Victory Bell. Uh, let's see what we get. Ooh, a Rockets Mewtwo. Look at look at that. I graded a four. Look at that swirl. Oh, look that that actually combines with his uh. It, it almost matches right there with his uh little power he's gonna do. Look at that. What else do we get? Vaporeon from the Pop Series 3. So, oh, look at that Sorrow. Where's Jolty on that? Check that out. Damn, almost at the same position. Nice. Got a few more cards. Hondur. Actually, I thought I, I would I would have thought this one would grade a little bit better. But maybe a eight. I mean a seven point five maybe. Look at that swirl right there. I know a lot of people like swirls. I think I might have a buyer for all these cards that have swirls. Gotta see. Ooh, Dark Dragonite. This one will sell fast. There's there's a lot of Dragonite fans out there. I actually got my Dark Dragonite uh, a, a pristine ten. I don't have it with me, but yeah, I paid I paid five hundred dollars for it. But man, that's a pristine ten, bro. Yeah, this one will sell fast, trust me. We got Hypno, 7.5. Any Hypno fans? Look at that swirl. I, I've actually I actually never been a Hypno fan. Not even in my favorite Pokemon trading card game. What we got? Ooh, Charizard from the celebrations. Man, can you believe these went up in price when CGC announced that they were gonna do that change? It went they went from 150 to 200 dollars Last sold, I think it was like 210. So this is a 210 dollars card. I, I that same day I actually was I actually uh, a guy contacted me. He said he wanted my Charizard and I was like, you know what? I'll sell it for the right price. And I told him 160. He said okay, and I was like, what? Like damn, he just didn't even he didn't even give me like a like a counter offer or anything. So I, I looked it up and that's when I saw that CGC had changed the 9.5 to 10. So I was like, ah, no wonder he bought that quick. But yeah, that, that one's going straight to my personal collection. This one graded an eight. I have no idea why. Like nothing, like no, like look at that. I think this, I think this it was a bad grade. I might even send it in. I really don't know what happened. This, this Charizard should not be, what is that? Okay, this Charizard should have been graded like a 9.5. I looked them over, and this this right here, this 8, is terrible, terrible. A terrible grade. Look at that centering. Look. Like, I really don't know why they gave it an 8. I'm kind of mad about this one. I might sell it, I might regrade it, I don't know. This is another Charizard. Yes, 9.5. I'm telling you, I looked them over. Before I, I send them to grade, I looked them over. And I was like, man, these Charizard look good, man. And now I got two $200 each. And they're going straight to my personal collection. What else do I got? A Jolteon. 
5.5. I'm almost done. I actually sent another another submission today. Misty's gold dug. Oh, look at that swirl, bro. Damn. That's a big swirl. Oops. Venusaur, I got a buyer for this one now. I think I'm going to sell it for $50. Look at that swirl in the back, bro. <laughs> nice. I actually have this one as a 9.5. I paid $200 for it. This one is going to go for like 50 Scar Murray. Look at that swirl, baby. Actually, I think I, I, I got a guy actually wanted this one. So there you go. I got like seven more cards. Ooh, Giovanni's Gyarados. A swirl. Bro, they, all these cards have a swirl. I didn't even know. Damn, that is a badass swirl. I wish mine had one. See, mine, mine doesn't have one. Damn, that sucks. We got uh, Misty's Gyarados. What else do we have? A slow king. Oh, this ha this actually graded nice. A uh, eight. I know there's a lot of fans that like this card right here. I I know I I won't have a problem selling this. Maybe eighty bucks, forty bucks. Oh, no 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 no. Seventy bucks. I'll probably sell it for seventy bucks. Cloister. Oh, I know somebody that wants it. Actually, I actually graded it because he wanted it. And I think this is a seventy dollar card, so I, I'm gonna message him right after after I end this and see if he wants it. But I'm pretty sure he does because he told me he wanted it. Light Dragonite, look at that. That's tough. That's tough. But I mean, I, I already knew it was gonna grade uh, bad because it was beat up. But it's still about a sixty dollar card. No doubt it'll sell. No doubt. Nido King, I don't know why this graded a five. Like, literally, this thing at least should have graded a seven. Not sure why it graded a five. Oh, I see why. Maybe that. I did not see that. And I, I be sending these cards in without even looking at them. The vintage ones, because the modern ones, I do look at them. I make sure that I'm gonna send them, and they grade good, and they pay off. It pays off. Arcanine, Sky Ridge. Now this is a card that I don't know why I graded 4.5. It should have graded at least a 6. See, like this one doesn't have anything in the back. Except for that winding and the corners button. Man, 4.5? Damn. And last card. A Sabrina's Gengar. Look at that. Actually, my Sabrina's Gengar, I just bought it for $400. It cost me $400, and um, I'm not selling it. It's my favorite card. If I do sell it, I think I think PSA 10s are going for, which I got it at a good price, $400. Uh, I think they're going for $600, $500, $500 to $600, and I got it for $400. So, yep. Alright guys, well I appreciate you guys watching and if you if you're interested in any of these cards, um go to the uh, comments because I'm gonna pin my Discord because that's where I sell them and I also sell them on my Facebook. So alright, thank you for watching and I'll catch you guys later.